Well, I couldn't help myself but join their singing. It is just infectious. Turning stadiums into a pop music concert is a tradition for Chengdu's football fans. It is how they show their support to the five-year-old team, Chengdu Rongcheng, which just managed to qualify to play in China's top football league last year. In the middle of this year, videos showing Chengdu fans singing were so popular online that everybody got to know more about the city's passion for football. So I decided to see what the buzz was all about. Despite the home court being temporarily relocated to the nearby city of Luoshan due to the Chengdu University Games, the two-hour drive didn't dampen fans' enthusiasm at all. I queued for more than three hours to get today's tickets, basically from 6 to 10 a.m. The stadium was full in every single game. It's really hard to get tickets. The online tickets were sold out in just one minute. Meanwhile, these men were lucky enough to get season tickets. One of them told me, combining all the costs, including tickets, jerseys, food, and gas, each would dole out around 4 to 5,000 yuan, or nearly 560 to 700 US dollars, each year on football related spending. That amount equates to roughly half of the average monthly salaries in Chengdu. The money I spend is definitely worth it. This is something I like. I'm also planning to bring my wife and the kids into this. Most fans made the two hour journey from Chengdu. They kept telling me that the number of audiences in this temporary place cannot compare to their regular home court in Phoenix Hill, which welcomes almost 40,000 fans each game so far this year. Despite the longer track to see their favorite team play, the mood of the crowd was still electrifying. Some are first-timers like me. Most people attending are veteran fans. Considering the intense ticket market this year, many have already pre-ordered their tickets for the next season. Loyal fans like us don't want to miss any game. Because it was so intensely difficult to secure tickets this year, we should plan early for next year. Even though the home team suffered a loss this day, fans still beamed their phone flashlights when the stadium lights were turned off and sang together. A show of solidarity for their hometown heroes. As the slogan says, it is all for a better city. <laughs>